snake number 10, and I still haven't succeeded in getting anything with him. That's his car. So I thought the brakes are going on our car. But anyway, this is near where the rubber snake was the other day. On the roof. But anyway, this one's in the laundry. And straight after this, that's where I hope. Uh, Fifty-nine. Is it number was it? This snake is in a couple of chicks' laundry. I think they're doing the right thing from what they said. They should be smashing out of my doors with you. You can. Okay. Let's get up off that ass. Yep. Do some work. Talk to you, Daisy. Let's jam that. Okay. Go away. See, now you're going to have to. I feel when you like the camera in my face. Yeah, I must smell like a doctor breakfast by now. Oh, I'm not gonna paint my gut. Knock knock. Hello. How are we? There's a card for future reference. We got someone on snake watch there. Oh, size is irrelevant. Whip snake? Yeah, right. I had to second guess myself there because the fact it's so dark. I wasn't sure whether it was an Eastern Brown or a whip, but it's a yellow faced whip. Which is venomous but not deadly. And this is as big as they get. They're communal. Um, not that you find many in the laundry, but if wherever this guy came from, he lived where there's heaps of rocks. But then again, Pimpham has been so developed so violently that he very well could have lived in a nice bit of land just recently and there's been bulldozers, you know. Yeah. Anyway, I'll stick this guy in the bag because... Um, let me put him in. Put it down the ground. Yeah. So his mummy's not going to be like in your garage? That's old enough to be mummy. Oh. oh. That's an adult. That's an adult? Yeah. Oh, cool. <laughs> hey, it's so really... Done and done. Oh, thank you.